Hi and welcome to a new video. Today uh, we have a challenge in front of us. More exactly we have an IPL uh, impulse uh, light uh, laser something. Well it's a hair removal tool yeah, for women. This is extremely expensive from, uh, from Philips. That has a problem. Yeah. Well, the problem is, let me show you, you know, even though it starts up, you, know, you can select the intensity and detects, has you know, the ready button. When I click the button, no pulse is um, flashing here. So nothing happens yeah. so I tried on the internet to find how to disassemble this uh, first part of the video or at least this video will be the part where I show you how to disassemble because on the internet you cannot find anything related to this what I did already is to disassemble this off camera so I can show you exactly what to do and not uh, lose one hour of your time just uh, uh, watching me uh, trying to disassemble. Yeah? What I can tell you up front is that this is extremely hard to disassemble. So it was not meant and it was not designed to be disassembled. So when you have, the, if you want the challenge, yeah, you can do it. If not, then just replace it with a new one or send it to a shop or something i can tell you it's extremely hard so maybe you saw already yeah i already started uh or at least didn't put this back because here are the the clips the bigger clips that are the hardest to remove yeah so what you need, you will need two prying tools, especially from plastic. Otherwise, you will damage the the nice looking plastic. Yeah. And maybe some uh, some uh, metal uh, tools like this prying tools. And uh, you will start by inserting uh, the plastic tools here on this side and on this side and try to push here so downwards also here on this area there is also a, a, a plastic clip that needs to be uh, yeah, removed also from here you have to pry on each side gently and the most important part is here because here are also again two or three clips and you will need to be really careful when you do this and i saw the easiest way is from this side yeah here just insert it yeah and it will be easier yeah, to remove you see it's already you can see the this comes off and now we have access over here and now gently when off so let me show you first yeah you can see here there are some uh, some clips here here and here there are three clips as you can see mine's already broken but it's not problem we can put them back and also here there is a clip on the other side there are two clips let me show you one over here and one over here so two clips yeah and here we have the trim as you can see on the uh, bottom side we have two clips that are going here and on the upper side we have three clips one over here one over here and one over here good so in order to disassemble further don't try to disassemble this 
uh, lens part this has to be uh, removed when the entire body is going up so uh, let me show you further so for this in order to remove the control panel you need to pry it a little bit on this side just a little bit and then you will have access on each side there are two clips one here and one over here so you have to gently don't do it like I do so I managed to open it once and not scratch it and now I will uh, I will oops okay so went easier this time so let me show you there is there are two clips over here and two clips on the other side and one clip here in the back of course for you it will be really really hard to disassemble yeah so as you can see there is one clip here two on each side yeah and here are the buttons and now we have access to the control panel over here and he is, here is the high voltage uh, part of the PCB this part is just uh, removable like this slides and in order to remove this uh, lens cover you will need a T8 Torx so a star and you have two screws one on each side so one over here and one over here once you have this uh, removed these two screws then you can gently uplift the entire unit yeah, remains only the, the the case and here oops there is uh, the lens cover for for the ready uh, color here we can put this aside and there are two one hook over here one on the other side and one down here and this way you can completely uh, remove the the lens like so and voila and here you have the the bulb and now uh, in my case what I suspect of being and I will do it right now I will start investigating the the, um, the culprit uh, of this with this problem is either this uh, super capacitor yeah or uh, the lens itself yeah so I will try to to resolve but for the moment this is a short video showing you uh, how to disassemble uh, this unit so i hope you enjoyed this video if yes give it a thumbs up consider subscribing if you have any question put them in the comment section below and uh, yeah see you in the next one thank you bye bye